everyone is doing great uh, welcome to my youtube channel if you are new kindly like subscribe and share so this is a simple tutorial where i will explain how you can put data from the form input into the excel file let's say you created a form and uh, you want the whenever user submit the form you want it, his data or her data uh, their data to be added into the excel file so for this i created simple form where i created three questions like first name last name and age group okay and then here is the excel file i named it test input uh, so let's say first column name will be first name then last name and then age group okay so make sure uh, your excel is uh, uh, excel has table like for example this is the simple column name uh, i will convert this into the table by clicking insert and then table okay click my table as header so column name will become header okay now this become the table what i need to do is click here then table design and rename the table if i want uh, i keep the default name okay now go to your power automate in here uh, click on new flow and then automated cloud flow okay name it let's say test input adder and then from here select when for new response is submitted okay Uh, I use uh, old version of the designer so switch to the old version as new version is uh, don't work uh, faster for me so I click here and uh, switch without saving as I did not created anything so I don't need to save it okay now I need to pick the form uh, my form name is test input form so I click here and it should appear in the drop down uh, this one okay and after this uh, whenever form is sub this form is submitted this get trigger now i will choose get form response to get the data from the form and this will ask for me to choose form again And then for the ID, I provide ID from the trigger. So now I will have all the data from the form. Whenever form is submitted, I need to add data into this Excel file. So for this, I will click new step. And then I will choose uh, this one, Excel online business. And I will choose add row. Okay, this one, add row into table. okay uh, i have this file on the my sharepoint site in the flow file so i will click here and then i will select my sharepoint site okay then i will select the do document library which is shared documents uh, i mean documents and then for the file i click here and choose my file manually from the pop-up it will be in flow files and then test input okay uh, if my file has table this way in this drop down our table should appear table one okay i select this and it will show me the rows that i can fill uh, so for the first name I select the first name from the form for the last name I choose the last name from the form and for the age group I will choose the age group from the form okay now my flow is ready uh, I need to save it and then test it
Okay, so I am gonna use test manually. This means that I need to submit the form. Uh, so flow start with running. As you can see here, the flow is waiting for the form to be submitted. And as you can see, it will keep waiting until I submit the form. I go back to the my form. Let's say I put my name. Let's say for the first name, I put first name, then last name. And then for the age group, I put, let's say this and then click submit. Okay. When I click submit, uh, here I will see form run, uh, flow running after few seconds. As you can see, your flow runs successfully. This means that row added into the Excel file. If I go to Excel file and refresh my page, I am refreshing the Excel file. I should see a new row get added here. As you can see, first name, last name, and then age group. So if I add another uh, submit another form, a new row get added and they keep getting added here. Uh, Can you do let me know in case you have any question or you don't understand any part or you are facing any difficulty with this or you have an idea which you want to implement in Power Automate. Uh, just let me know and I try to create a tutorial for that. Thank you.